Hey everybody, I just want to show y'all the sketchbook I completed. Uh, this is some drawings that I made like in 2019, 2020, 2021, maybe 2022. And then I took a break from drawing from like 2023 and then continued drawing in 2024. And I actually completed this sketchbook in, at the end of 2024. No, the end of 2023, but I never made the sketchbook tour. So I'm not going to make y'all wait any longer. Let's see how this sketchbook is so it's kind of this is kind of ripped you know what i'm saying i've been kind of messing up the sketchbook when i was like bringing it to other places to go draw but let's start it boom oh my god it doesn't even flip anymore <laughs> yeah so this is a drawing uh this one is really like inspired by uh gox art i don't know how, how do you call this guy gox i don't know like he he, do, he does like a lot of drawings where he does like some little characters that you may recognize like everywhere so here you got pikachu uh you got the ghost from mario um you got spongebob you got a fall guy when fall guys was really really popping uh, kirby on the top right if you can see the letters it says dilla's design so my last channel actually got banned and that was the name of my channel but i'm, I'm kind of mad that it happened but i changed the channel name to dzd art just to make it easier for the viewers to find the channel and this is what it looks like so can I zoom in? Yeah, there's a bunch of like random characters in the middle. But I don't know. I really look, liked how it looks. It's good for a first page just to see like who I am. Oh, yeah. There's also Charmander. Charmander. Baby Charmander right there. Hey, you already know, man. So this was supposed to be, this was supposed to be Yoruichi from Bleach. But like I kind of messed out the drawing. I mean, it's a cool drawing, but like it's not nothing too crazy. I, I could have done better. But it was like my second drawing. So, you know, like second drawing back, I didn't expect to be that good. But like at least decent. And I guess this is kind of decent, but I could have done better. Next, this is Hinata. It's supposed to be Hinata from Naruto, but I messed it up horribly. The arm is messed up. I don't even know what the hell I did right there. Oh, no. I don't, my my su art supplies were not that good either. But like I could have done a better a better job than that. I'm not going to lie. I can I think this is where I started doing like some type of uh, Inktober, like back in 2019 or 2020. And I don't know, it, it does like some type of illusion that there's like something squeezing these circles. And it looked cool, so I just did it. I think I saw like a trend on TikTok or something like that. It's pretty cool, you know, saying so nothing too crazy. Yeah, that I was doing Inktober. So this is like one of the Pokemon. I forgot what, what's his name again? It's like, it's not Ghastly. It's like Haunter or something like that. It's like Mega Haunter because, you know, the Pokemon's got ev super evolutions right now. Yeah, I don't know. My so art supplies are not that great either. But, like, I try my best to do, like, some blending and, like, color changing. So, I don't know. I, I find it looks cool. Looks cool. Nothing too crazy, you know? Ooh, that one is cool. Yeah, I'm a Dragon Ball Z fan. You already know. It's probably the best anime of all time. But, yeah, this is trunks super saiyan 2 or something like that or super saiyan 3 and there's a f i used to play a game called dragon ball budokai and he was a character in the game and he was kind of overpowered in that game too so hey this is a good drawing i like how i did the muscle the shading for the muscle definition and also for like the what he has worn and everything next i don't know there, that was another prop from an inktober thing that i was trying to do I think it was like, I don't even know what was the word of the prop, but that, that's a character from a game. I forgot the name of the game. What the hell? It's like Sly Cooper, isn't it? Isn't it him? Sly Cooper? Anyways, I don't know. I, I found it like a, a little image and I just drew him and it's pretty cool. He's like a PlayStation video game character. Next. Ooh, yeah. I like this one. I don't know. I think this is also Inktober and drew Jess Jessica Rabbit. You know what I'm saying? I did like something where i didn't draw like the bottom half then i made it into like some type of artistic i don't know i like how i did this i like the proportions they look like really cartoony maybe a little bit too much cartoony but like i don't know i like what i did Ooh, this is a you know that that ghost character from from death note i drew him i want to make sure that this is on frame because it's a bigger drawing yeah i don't know there's a there's like a part at the end of the series where he shows his face and then like it zoomed in on his face but you see like the city in the background and I did that 
honestly, it didn't turn out how I wanted it to turn out, but that's the best I could do, you know? So, hey, shout out to Death Note. Ooh, next, we got Waluigi. I don't even know what, what was, I think the, th the prop for that Inktober thing was Fireball. So I was like, hey, instead of drawing Mario, Wario, and Luigi, might as well draw this guy. And that's what I had with, I think that prop for that Inktober was Super or like Hero or something like that. And I was like, you know what? I don't even want to draw the whole Superman. Let's draw just like his logo with some type of graphic design type of thing. I actually used a, a ruler to like make sure that stuff is kind of good. But I still kind of messed it up because I think this side is kind of longer than this side. But it's you, see, you get the concept. It's Superman. I don't know. One thing that is cool about using alcohol markers is when like they kind of like, I don't know. It's like if like when it runs out, you could still use the marker to do like some type of textures with it so definitely try to keep that with it you know the prop was probably like a zombie or like monster or something so that's what i did a zombie head i also redrew this head uh digitally with my i think art tablet or ipad and yeah i don't know i, I really like this drawing i've just found a zombie head on google and i drew it because it was like pretty cool and it made sense it just made sense to draw that character. Next, oh, another one. It was like, I don't know what the hell, what? I just saw an image on Google again and I redrew it. And it, that that looks pretty cool. That looks super cool. Like, some somebody on Instagram was like, hey, can I use this to make a t-shirt with it? Or like make a hat? I don't know. I just found the image on Google and then I remade it. So, I don't know. That was, it looks pretty cool. I like how I did it. It looks like a satisfying drawing right there. From what I remember from this drawing, I don't know what, but it says like a prop called Dune. And I think a Dune is like some type of desert type of situation. And I just went on Google again, found an image uh, with like, just to see how sand looks. But like my markers were not that great to like try to make stuff. I could, I, I wanted to try to, to try to add like a cactus over here or something, but it didn't work. I don't know. Yo, I'm into video games, so yo, you already know. I drew Yasuo from League of Legends as like a chibi character. That's like what I got from it. I don't know. I really like that drawing. It looks it looks cool. You know, like the guy got like his little shield thing over here, his sword. He looks like a dang ninja up in here. That's like no. Ooh, I gotta do more stuff like this. This, I don't know. I was trying to do like some type of Bob Ross type of type of situation right here, like. So it's like a circle and then you have like a some type of snow island with mountains in the back, background and snow just going down. And I did I use some I don't know if I used no, no I think that was all alcohol markers was it? No. Hold on. Yeah, so this is when Among Us was really popping. I don't know. I think I was scrolling down through Instagram and then one artist that I follow on Instagram did a like a major drawing where he had a lot of among Us characters just doing some random stuff. And then I saw like a an Among Us character with some type of sword who was like glowing. I was like, yo, this looks cool, man. This looks cool as hell. I gotta get dang draw that thing for myself. And at the time I was only using alcohol markers, but for this one I think I used uh some paint markers actually that I ordered. They were okay, but not that great. It was some cheap ones that I got from like Amazon or AliExpress or something like that or even Timu. No, I don't think it's Timu. Next, ooh. I think the, the prop for the word was Storm and I drew Storm from X-Men. There was like some type of chibi one that I found online. And I don't know, I really like the style that it was. I tried to do like some lightning stuff with the with the paint markers, but it didn't end up how I wanted it to be. It looked like really complicated to do, but I really like how I did the hair though. The hair looks really nice for that one. Oh, okay, so this is this is where stuff got bad, okay? So, Inktober, you have to do drawings, like, every day to, like, post. At a certain time, I was too tired to, to draw, but I still wanted to post stuff thing. And then I, it was something called, like, a, a trap for the word. And I did, like, a bear trap or bear paw trap. Honestly, I don't know why I did that. It was a horrible drawing, but it Man, I don't know what the hell I was doing. This, whoo, no, not that drawing not that drawing either so i don't know i think for this prop word it was spiral still in inktober and this is where like i kind of crashed out and like i kind of quit drawing for like a good like six seven months because i was like yo 
what the hell am I doing with this? This was horrible. It was supposed to be like like the Madara Uchiha mask thing. Or, or but, what is his name? No, it's the Obito mask type thing. And it was supposed to do like some type of illusion where like everything is spinning, you know? But like, it looks horrible. This is like the most horrible drawing I ever, ever... Let's not talk about this one. Let's not talk about this one. At the time, yeah, so I did like this little horse fish. Or, or, or sea, I don't know. Seahorse fish. I don't know. What do you call it? Maybe should have added some colors, but like, like I said, I was doing Inktober and on Inktober, like I was getting lazy, man. I was just like, you know what? I'm just going to do line work at this point, but I don't know. This is a really good drawing. We got Snorlax in the building, you know, nice little line work of that. Nothing too crazy. This is supposed to be Sanji from One Piece, but like I was just doing, I just did the line work because I was just being lazy. I'm not going to lie. I don't know. Inktober. That's why like, I don't do Inktober anymore because it's like, it's kind of stressful, man. It's like, yo, you're trying to draw, but then you have a prop to do, and then you, get, you gotta upload it, like, the next day. Like, most people that I heard on Instagram doing Inktober, from now on, like, they, they draw the drawings, like, in advance, and then they, like, pre-post them, which is partly something that I should do, but I'm lazy because I gotta go to work and stuff, so, hey, I don't do Inktober anymore. I just, like, draw whatever I want to draw, you know? So, next. That's, I don't know, this is the... There's a show called Billy and Mandy, and this is a character from that show. And I forgot his name, but like if if you know this show, props to you. Next we got Diglett. I don't know why I drew that. It was probably an Inktober thing too. Like I said, like I was lazy. I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna do line work. A zombie dog. I don't know why I drew that. Probably Inktober also. Inktober drawing right there. This is Toph. Wait. What do you call that character? She's from Avatar. Her name is Toph. Or tough or tough. I don't know the rock girl who is like one of the airbender. I don't know one of the, like the the Hokages of the 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 stone village or whatever you call it from the. I don't know. I drew some type of rock star for the next drawing. Also for Inktober. Uh, I don't know what the hell is that guy's name. If you know his name, tell me in the comments because I don't know. It just looked cool when I was drawing it. Also Inktober stuff. Um. Drew like some type of eagle head. All right, I don't know why I drew this, but it's like some Jordan shoes who are like kind of dripping, who are who are melting or anything, like, something like that. I think at the time I was doing some beats and I needed like a some type of image like that for some beats, and then I drew that to see if I can put that and post another Inkto Inktober image. So it's a, something that was supposed to be posted for Inktober. I was getting lazy. Yo, you, you can see I was getting lazy, dog. What the hell is this? Like, I could have done something crazier, like maybe like a, a head of a pumpkin with like a body and then, you know, paint. Well, not paint it. Draw it and then do some, how do you call it? Some shading with it. But I was too lazy, man. Like, that's why I don't do Inktober anymore, man. Like, pleasing, you know? Next one. Oh, that's one of my favorite drawings I ever made. See, like, when, when I apply myself, you know what I'm saying? When I apply myself... This is where, like, I'm like, I right, yeah, this is a good drawing. I think I was doing this one for Inktober also. I think the name for the, the word was Venom, and that's all I thought about. Like, I remember I seen, like, a, a Spider-Man post of, like, a movie, and the, the movie was, the poster was literally Venom on the half and Spider-Man on the other side. Next one, okay. Yeah, this is a drawing. Yeah, this is a drawing I tried to do, like, Basically, I play a lot of League of Legends. This is a character called Aurelion Soul. Um, I kind of gave up on that drawing because the image I used to draw this was so complicated. And, like, I don't think my equipment was good enough and my skills were not good enough and, to complete that. So, I'll, I might redo this drawing in the future. But, like, yeah, I kind of gave up on that drawing. But it looks cool. Like, in retrospect, when I look at it right now, I'm just like, yo, it's not even that bad. I should have continued it. Boom, so I drew like a gangster Spongebob. I kind of, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of did this drawing for a beat I posted on my music channel. The next drawing after this. So, we got Aaron, also the Funko Pop style on the bottom right. Top left, anime style, tried to do my best. So, this is Aaron from Attack on Titan, from like the one of the most recent seasons where... He acted like 
was like some type of crippled guy and i don't want to spoil y'all but this is Eren from attack on titan i don't know I, li I like how i did this i'm not gonna lie this is an epic fail this is an epic fail this it was supposed to be levi from attack on titan but dressed as a naruto character but my skills were so not good that it doesn't even look like okay so over here i was doing some really random stuff wait no no ripped my drawing accidentally i was practicing some figure drawings and i don't know this one sucked like i think the best one i did was this one over here on the bottom right but like i don't know i don't like it that much i don't know actually the one on the bottom left i, I kind of like this one these ones i don't know what happened i don't know man some of them did not did not look right i was just practicing but it it did not end actually the one the, that one on the bottom left is kind of good i don't know because the, the pose is easier than the other ones that one i think i find it a little bit better and then oh uh, i don't even think y'all is going to be able to see this because i was doing it with pencil but like i think the pencil got like smudged and you can't really see anything this character on the top left if i can zoom in that would help i don't know i like the top left i was just practicing and it's a pretty cool character i might try to redraw it another time with like color and stuff because it was a pretty good drawing this over here is just like a page that i used to use to do like my art tutorials be like videos so it's the video where like you draw an ugly drawing and then you zoom in with it with your camera and then you switch it to like the drawing that is completed and then you zoom it out with the camera and i used to use this page to do that thousand views or like a hundred thousand views that was pretty crazy but anyways so this is where like i was i was entering like my, my TikTok era so there was the trend of drawing doing a drawing in four different styles and i chose to draw to draw mario in four styles so the top left over here is like some type of demon mario with the fire and everything the right side is like frosted mario he's like cold change the color of his hat and everything and even the flame is different that's the left the bottom left was like some type of uh i don't know some type of drip i think they call it a drip and it looks like he's like melting a little bit then the right side i don't know i i wanted to do like some type of poison like he has like some snot who is like kind of poisony or like i don't know it's purple i don't know what the hell i was doing so again tiktok era uh, this was the Bowser, you know, uh, the Mario movie got out and then, you know, the song Peaches, 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 Okay, I can't, I can't go that high, god damn, I can't sing, I can't sing to save my life, but I don't know, I like what I did, I think I used mostly, it looks like him, but like the colors are not as accurate as I wanted them. I actually did this drawing at work, <laughs> so like I was drawing... Um, there was no calls for a while and I was like chilling at work and yeah I work at a call center sometimes when you get like no calls and like the managers are all gone and I'm like yo what the hell do I do I just like put like a image of Ichigo from Bleach and I was drawing it like with no like no sketching and no like redrawing or anything I just went straight to like the final drawing which I'm pretty surprised it ended up pretty well we got peaches 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 put this thing higher a little bit so yeah this is peach you know from the mario i'm not gonna lie i'm pretty proud of how i drew this because it kind of looks a lot like the peach from the mario movie that got out like last year you know with the peaches 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 like it looks more like the movie peach than the peach from the video game i don't know if you understand what i mean but like paint markers on that one so i'm pretty proud of that you already know i'm a i'm a dragon ball fan man shout out to goku man one of the greatest anime characters of all time so uh this one did i how did i do this did i sketch i don't even think i bam vegeta i think i actually drew this character like last because i don't know because i knew like after goku i wanted to draw vegeta but like i didn't want to draw vegeta in a different page i wanted to draw it behind uh the the goku drawing so then i drew this and also yo rest in peace to akira toriyama the guy who created dragon ball man this guy's a legend crazy man like this anime like dead ass like 
it raised me, you know, like this anime is like the greatest anime of all time. And, you know, I rewatched it like about like three or four times. I might have to rewatch it one t more time. I think in TikTok, there was some people just m commenting like which character I should draw next. And then they're like, Toad, Toad, Toad. And then like, I drew Toad and this kind of looks like also the one from the movie. So, so on the, the channel that I got banned, I reached 2000 subscribers. So I just wanted to do like a little 2000 kind of like number here and thank, like thanking the, the viewers to, for watching my stuff. But guess what? That channel got banned and now I made a new one and I'm at like 3,500 subscribers right now. So, hey, I could have, if that channel didn't get banned, I could have been like at 10,000 and but now I'm also being a procrastinator. So like I try to draw and then I quit and then I come back. But I'm trying to get back to it. You know what I'm saying? We got Luigi. I don't know. That was a good drawing too. You know, like because of the movie, like the P uh, the Mario movie that got out, I was just trying to draw a lot of stuff that has to do with Mario because, you know, I was trying to get them views up. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get them subscribers up, you know? What the hell is this? No, I'm playing. Uh, so this is actually like some paper that I used to like, because whenever you draw, oh, wait, whenever you draw, like, in the back of the page, you might see, like, some extra colors. And this is just to protect the page who is on the back because I don't want to waste a lot of paper. And I have multiple. I went to, like, some type of art gallery, and there's a girl who was working there, and she really liked these papers for some reason. She's like, yo, this is artistic. You should try to frame that or something. But, like, it's weird. Maybe I might. I might do some type of framing of these and see if that can go for something in the future. I'm actually a graphic designer and I had to write some notes for something from the for the exam and that's the notes. I don't know, it's something about whenever you try to like print some cards it's f for you to waste less paper, you have to like try to flip the the tablet like this or like this. I don't even know, man. I don't even remember how it works. But like the thing is that whenever I graduate my graphic designing stuff, I'm probably not going to use these because I'm probably going to do all of my stuff online. All right, next. Boom. We got Miles Morales. I kind of like this is one thing. I don't think the the color is accurate. Like the, the skin tone color I had was not matching with the one that I saw on the reference image. But that's the best I can do. But I really like how I did this drawing. I don't know. Like, it, it's really, like, satisfying to rock, to watch. I don't know. It's pretty cool. Like, the afro is well done. And I like how, like, because there wasn't that much ink on my black marker, it makes it look like his hair is actually some hair because... So I drew Miles Morales again with his spider suit. I kind of messed it up. It's the best I could do. I don't know why. It's the same type of... Yeah, this is when the, the, the multiverse Spider-Man thing got released so i was really into like trying to draw that on tiktok I drew her without the the mask on and with the mask on just to like you know shout out to future mask off fucking mask off no, <laughs> i don't know it looks really cool i really this is one of my top five drawings too i don't know i just like how like i shaded stuff maybe the eyes are kind of messed up but i like how the afro looks because you know like my marker was kind of running out of ink but it kind of makes it look like if it's hit so again same spider-man but with the suit so that was like my what i was trying to do so i was trying to paint the character and then the character in a suit Car paint the character without the suit paint the character with the suit Luffy from one piece there's an episode where he if you don't want to get spoiled you probably already got spoiled because you already see that he he unleashed a new gear so i think he has gear four but i think this is gear five which is like Kind of like a Super Saiyan 5 One Piece. Ooh. I don't know. There was an image where it was like him just holding his sword with his mouth. I kind of messed up the drawing, guys. So, I don't know. I like how I did everything. So, everything looks cool. Like the little rocks in the background. And sometimes when he does like his sword moves, he has like some type of green flames around him. And that's what I was drawing like on the sword over here around him. And also, I don't know why. No, actually it's true. Sometimes when he does like his, his, his sword moves, there's a dragon that pops up. So I was like, you know what? Let me add like a little drag dragon on the top to show like his aura of his sword, you know? 
and that's what I did. But like, if you look at the bottom over here, my ink markers kind of messed up and then I dropped some on him. I was kind of mad of it, but there's nothing I can do, you know, like I, I couldn't like reset that. I was like, you know what? Let's just keep it like that. It's just in the front and also the side. It was, it's kind of good to like practice like that sometimes just to, just to like get your mind flowing, you know. Artist called Josh Art. I see him do a lot of sketching with like pencils. And I was like, you know what? Let me try to do my own version of it. But like, that's the best I can do. And from one thing that I'm noticing, markers, Nyx, we got this. I don't know. I like, I kind of like these drawings. I'm not going to lie. I cannot, what the hell is going I don't know, it backfired. I don't know what I did wrong, but like I was trying and it didn't end up the way I wanted it to. The bottom left was kind of cool. This, some girl from Pinterest that I drew. It, it didn't really look like her, which is, I'm kind of sad. Like my skills are not good enough to like redraw like a, a face, like directly how it looks like on a paper. The thing is that I want it to be like stylistic if ever I do this. I don't want. All right, yeah, so for this character, he's called Zenitsu from Demon Slayer. Pretty cool character. I don't know, I saw I saw an image on Google, and I was like, you know what, let me draw that. Since I was on the theme of drawing the main characters, the dang pork on his head with the two swords. I don't know what the hell his name is, but I don't know. I think I did a great job. Probably, probably could have did a better job. I didn't really like it, but I just wanted to continue the theme of the Demon Slayer stuff that I was drawing. Next, hey, League of Legends, you already know I'm a, I'm a League of Legends player. Uh, there was Arcane, which is a show that popped out. Who's like some League of Legends characters who has like their story time going on about whatever the hell they're doing. And I'm a fan of the video game, so I watched that. And then, so this is my actually my main character from League of Legends, Shen. Um, top laner, you know what I'm saying? He's a really tough character, tanky character, hey. I was like, you know what, I have to draw him. I kind of messed up the drawing, but I kind of like how it looks at the same time, even though I messed it up. So, hey, I might redo another drawing of him. TikTok slash shorts ad. Uh, not, uh, like, just like the art uh, art challenges that be, they be posting. Um, basically, they want you to draw, like, one character in four different styles. So, the original styles. And this is Five Nights at Freddy's. And then... I don't know, I did like a square style, which is like kind of 3D. I don't know. It looks kind of cool. There's a guy who did golden style, so I was like, you know what? I'm going to draw him in completely gold. And this is like the X-ray style. I don't even know what the hell it is. but like Another one, which is Foxy from uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. Four different styles. Original, golden, also ice, which is kind of like the frozen style or whatever. And poison, where it's broken and everything is like just dripping from his holes that he has inside Damn, this is my worst one i don't like this one but i did it so this is chica five nights at freddy four different styles i just wanted to see how it looked like with markers the paint oh this is the the different met ones i have so i have the the paint marker no the alcohol markers paint markers uh, a pen regular pen that you can like write with and the pencil so it looks pretty cool just to see like how the markers are compared to like different medium next i think this is bonnie from five nights at freddy uh drew him in different styles but is that a girl character or is it a guy i don't even know so original version on the top left and then i was like you know what let me redraw it but like as a human face so it's like some type of male character with like a a uh what do you call it a bonnet not a bonnet a beanie yeah and still keep the same eye color a little bit bigger just to make it look more huge. Next, no, this one is the best one. One, this is probably one of my top five drawings too. I'm not gonna lie, like it's it's just like look aesthetically pleasing, dog. Like it just looks way too good. So this is the original, and then this is like the poison style. I don't know what the hell style it is, but like I just wanted to have something different. And the ice style on the bottom right. Um, I don't know. It looks so. You know, it looks like. It, it looks really satisfying. This is last year, uh, last December, which is l December 2023. I drew Pikachu as a get dang Santa Claus. And I don't know, I saw the image on online and I was like, you know what? L let me draw this for, for Christmas, you know? So I did that and pretty satisfied with that one. It looks like Pikachu. There was some girl on YouTube who blew up 
from doing like some little doodle stuff like this. And I was like, yo, man, since she blew up, let me try to do that. And I, I never blew up because of that. I'm kind of sad because she's doing it. And then it blew up on her page, but it did not blow up on my page. Maybe I have to continue and try it again. I might do it like on my other sketchbook that I have, which is on the left of me. But hey, it looks pretty cool. And then we were still, I still did that in uh, December 2023. Um, I think there was a new Grinch movie that got out. And I was like, you know what, might as well draw that for some content on TikTok and... I don't think I released it as a full video on YouTube, but I don't know, because I didn't really like the drawing at the end of the day. I kind of like the, the bottom left one because of the paint markers. It looks kind of satisfying. That's the last drawing, actually. Boom. This is, uh, what's his name? Gojo from uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Uh, I think I was just like, you know what? Let me draw some anime characters. I'm just trying to draw, like, whatever is popular at the time, you know, so... Jujutsu Kaisen was kind of popping during that time and drew him and I like how I did it. I probably could have done it better, but it was kind of like a zoom in type of. Yeah, I have a lot of purple colors. So I was like, you know what? Might as well draw this guy because you're going to make me use. But yeah, this was actually all of my drawings, guys. So tell me what you think in the comments. Um, I have another sketchbook that I'm working on and I have to get back into doing digital art. So. I was kind of procrastinating on this video because I knew it was going to take some time to record and the editing is probably going to be crazy. But yeah, uh, if you have some characters you want me to draw, uh, tell me in the comments. Uh, you know, I'm working on another sketchbook and, you know, keep on growing the page, man. The, the Instagram, the TikTok, and the YouTube. Uh, let's try to reach 10K, man. Let's try to reach 10K. I don't know how it's going to be possible, but hey, tell me what you think in the comments about my sketchbook drawings and more to come for the future. But yeah, I'm going to end the video over here. Thanks for watching, and we out. Deuces!